This is plush. This is nice. Although those rear seats are pointless. Should I swap an R8 for it though? Probably not. All right. All right. Um, slight complication. All right. Guy just rung me saying his father-in-law's just died, so he can't do it today. Oh, are you kidding? No. He said he was the only one there today. Normally there'd be someone else. Oh. Tomorrow I can do it. So I'm just gonna have a quick look on Art Trader now. See if we can, so we can find another one. <laughs> right. We're um. Result. Sort of. Yeah. We're now off to go look at this. <laughs> if you can see that. <laughs> we're off to go look at a Ferrari 430. Because. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> so it keeps eye happy. Go have a look. Um, but right. we'll be a bit daft going to look at a Lotus and ended up coming back with a Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> but what are you going to do? Stranger things have happened. Yeah, stranger things have happened. <laughs> first time we went to look at an R8 ended up buying it, didn't we? We're just like, yeah. right, we'll just go look at this first one, then we'll go look at a few more. Came back and bought it. Well, same with the M3. On the way there, yeah. he was like, yeah, and that's the show. I'll go look at it. Yeah, Next thing I know, he's fucking putting the positive down, yeah, trying to stop it. <laughs> I think about it. Standard. Yeah. Standard. Done deal. So, I mean, we could come out of this with anything, really. <laughs> They've got a lot of nice cars there, so who knows? I mean, if they'll finance him on a Veyron, you never know. <laughs> it's not really what was meant to happen in this, this series of, of finding a track car, but. I'm sure it's good on a track. It's very good on a track, it's yeah. Very well drive. Yep. It fits all the criteria, really. Very well drive. It's um, cheap. <laughs> if you're building there, it's super cheap. Yeah. So yeah, it's all relative. Yep. You know, five grand isn't cheap to some people. No. So no. 85 grand is Five. cheap to some people. Yeah. So it's that so. logic. That terrible <laughs> logic. <laughs> um, but yeah, well, to be fair, it would cost me roughly the same to get that because I could trade this in for around 70. So I would have to put like 15 grand towards it. So it's, I'm, yeah. spending, I'm spending the same You're spending amount. You're 15 grand either way. Yeah. Yeah. So why not come out with a Ferrari instead of a Lotus? I mean, come on, a Lotus yeah. or a Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> We're attempting to set the sat nav to go to see this Ferrari, but the Audi system. The Audi sat nav is terrible. It only lets you put in half a postcode. Like, there's as much of a postcode as you can put in. And, and then you, it asks for the street. You can't just say, like, anywhere in that postcode. You've got to put the street in. So I've got to use my phone to Google Maps the street <laughs> to be able to set this sat nav. And it won't let me put in the road that it's actually on for some reason. Fucking terrible. Audi, get your shit together. You've made the Can worst sat nav in there. Can't even put lower fucking. Oh. Below. Oh, dear. Like, my fucking TomTom -tom that I got when I was 17 <laughs> had better options than this. And that was 10 years ago nearly. Not, there's no excuse for not having been able to put in full postcode. No, there is no reason. In 2014. There is zero benefit <laughs> and lots of disadvantages. So why are you doing this? Oh, nice. There was nothing behind them, but it's actually it's a little bit. Yeah. Well, it's carbon dash as well, so, isn't it? It's yeah, it's a lot more like, because like the R8 has got sat nav and yeah. this is like this is basic. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? Just it's drive. It's all the car now. But it's, it does have nav, but it's not the, the nice big scale yeah, yeah. they've got in there. Oh, it does have? Yeah, just it's like, radio nav. Oh, right, okay. It just goes through the, the Just the speakers, yeah. A very small arrow. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, okay. I didn't realise it had anything. Like the, the yeah. yeah. A bit more like space in it than I thought. You can see the engine on there, can't you? Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. I, just, I didn't really like that. It's, 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 it's,
is a nice uh, yeah. huge there for Lotus, isn't it? What's the not the 60 on your V10? Uh, I think it's 3.9 or 4.1, yeah. I can't remember. It's so around 4 seconds. I mean, these are 4.4. Yeah, so obviously still... they, uh, the handling on them is pretty much next level. Yeah. Next to the... Yeah, next to the... Of course, quite. Yeah, I love the central exhaust as well. Yeah. It's really cool. That's sweet. Especially the black wheels with the red calipers as well. It's really nice. They've got a bit of a boot then, haven't they? Bit of a boot. I don't like that, to be honest. I don't like it. I love that orange. I love that orange. But... Yeah, but... This is plush inside. It's like, especially after getting out of an Elise. Yeah. It's so, like, soft. Back in the R8. R8. <laughs> Buy one of these. Buy one of these. It's got nice. It's how many miles? It's so fucking hot. If you're um, Jesus. Yeah. We're in the market for an RX8. Buy an R8 instead. Yeah. That's what we've discovered. Um, we're, we're always giving the the subscribers uh, like useful, top on useful information. Top yeah. gear ain't got nothing on this shit. Yeah. Mm -mm. Oh yeah. Oh, this is how we do. Breakfast. Breakfast. <laughs> I'm not good, bro. Mmm. I'm about to eat them. <laughs> Bit advertising. Yeah. Well, eat them. Give us some money. Yes. Or more OG biscuits. That's how it works. That's how it works. You show the product. Yeah. They send you a check for four million pounds. Oh, like a lifetime supply. I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, um, I'll eat them now. This car is a state. <laughs> this car is an absolute state. Oh, oh, look at this. Yeah, but it's a Sticky daily. Sweets. Oh, oh, God, another one. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Put our fingers on Rhea. Oh, here he comes. Oh. He's sticking his fingers on. <laughs> He's our friend, honest. Yeah. <laughs> Follow him. Follow him. Right. Oh, yeah, so now we're driving the Cupra to York to pick the Elise up. I mean, you're going to drive this back. What? You oh, said shit. <laughs> you said Elise. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Head it out. See what Cy thinks. Cy knows a lot about low tie, don't you? Yeah. yeah. Low tie, the plural of Lotus. See how he stylishly gets in. <laughs> take, two, take, take two. right, take two. Cool. Cool. Almost. Cool. <laughs> it's very cozy, isn't it? You can't change gear without touching the other person. Yeah, it's, it's a very... bit like. <laughs> have we got a little pumpy things? Why don't I have a little pumpy thing? Oh, I do. How do you let it down? He said there was a mark on there. I don't mind. Uh, there's a button. Yeah, there's a button. Yeah. But it doesn't seem to be getting any tighter. I'm like, I'm pumping. I don't. You've got to pump a lot though. you got to go ham on this shit. Jesus. <laughs> it's all about building your strength up to, yeah, to, to be able to drive this. It's, yeah. it's, it's, it didn't make much difference, but then when you let it down, you feel it. Don't yeah, you? no, you're not too much. Done. Sort of. Oh, oh. I'm going to break another camera now. It's not going to be over if I break this one. A bit more expensive than a GoPro. And I'm driving the cop out. Not a bad car, I guess. Plastic on the steering wheel's a bit. A bit plastic, though. Not sure about that. And it's got six gears. I'm not used to a six gear. Forget about it. Hey, it's a six slug. There you go. 30 mile an hour. 70, 40, 50 mpg. There you go. Economical. <laughs> Oh. Can you see us? Can you see us? 